The Classic Handicap Chase is one of Warwick's biggest races of the season. It's a Grade 3 handicap and should be a pretty big feel for this. Three mile five furlongs and the top one is Flashpoint for Leon van Rensburg. Lord of the National, Joshua Sutherland, Lady Matilda, Jim Murray, Plague Runner for Greg Allen, Sunday Mott, Thomas Rogers, Panzer Martin, Leadham, Enemy Flight, Darren Thompson, Shamadal Phantom, Thomas Rogers, Fearless Amy, Ryan Tamasebi, Bucco Martin, Leadham, Put the Kettle on, David Hooley, Lord Butt, Jim Murray, Labanese, Craig Beckwith, Camp House, B. Fotheringham, New Blood, Burt, Vinnie Gerard, Eager and Keen, Graham Clutterbuck, Lexington Regal, Vinnie Gerard, Safinaz Josie for David Robertson, Stagecoach for Graham. Clutterbuck and coin feather for Ryan Costello. They're racing from under the big screen then and past the winning post. And it's Eager and Keen who is going to be the first one to show. Stagecoach also keen on leading. So the Grand Clutterbuck pair are disputing the lead between them at the moment. With Lexington Regal. In third in the green and the, in fourth place is Enemy Flight in those white sleeves. And a bit of a gap then to a line of three. Two Jim Murray horses, Lady Matilda and Lord Butt. And Fearless Amy closest to us. We've just tucked in behind that one Sunday Mock and then Lord of the National. And on the inside Bucko. And the one wide on the track, Safin has Josie looking towards the back New Blood Burt. Probably just the early back markers, they finally get to the first of the 20. Uh, they're all safely to the other side of that one. Um, they are getting quite stretched out already, to be honest. And Stagecoach is in the lead from Stablemate Eager and Keen, who's in second. He says Eager and Keen to catch the Stagecoach, isn't he? Lexington Regal is back in third. And Enemy Flight and Lord Button Lady Matilda. With Fearless Amy after that one, and then Lord of the National, and then Sunday Mott. And the just after that one on the inside, I think, is Bucco, or Bucco and Panzer, one of, the, one of the two. One of them's on the inside, one of them's on the outside as they get over the next. And Stagecoach is the leader. Two lengths clear of Eager and Keen in second, who's got a good three up on a third placed horse as they get over. Fence number three, which they're all safely over as well. Stagecoach leads Eager and Keen second. And Enemy Flight third. Lord Butt is after that one. Lexington Regal's just dropped back into fourth. Then Fearless Amy and Lady Matilda. Lord of the National. One on debut last week as they get to number four. And a mistake there was by Bucco. And that's all that one shuffle back to the back part of the field. And they're quite well strung out as they get to the fifth. The pace being set by this Graham Clutterbuck pair. Eager and Keen and Stagecoach. And they're three lengths clear of Enemy Flight, who's third, and Lord Butt, who's fourth. Then there's a gap back to Lexington Regal and Lady Matilda, and then Lord of the National, and then Fearless Amy Panzer has just tucked in behind them on the inside. And skips over that one nicely. Then there's a little bit of a gap of a couple of lengths then to the rest of them who are headed by Plague Runner in the green and the yellow. Behind that one, the pink of Camp House. And then Sunday Mott and New Blood Burt Buckos on the outside of Shamadal Phantom with Safanaz Josie also on its inside looking to the Bat Labanese coin feather flashpoint and put the kettle on for the back markers and there's a long long way to go yet as they get down to this ditch and over it they all go and Shamadal Phantom has gone at that one so Shamadal Phantom is a faller and the first one to depart the race as they make their way towards the next fence and they get over that one there now racing towards the final two miles of the race and stagecoach and eager, eager and keen oh, Graham Clutterbuck will be hoping that they're not cutting each other's throats up the front there as they get over that one a uh, bit of a slow jump by Panzer but it's eager and keen who's in the lead now by a couple to stagecoach in second then enemy flight third and Lord but four then there's a significant gap to Lexington Regal as they take that one that was the tenth and they come up past the big screen. That one they've just taken will be the final fence on the next circuit. And it's Eager and Keen in the lead then. Eager and Keen is in front. From in second place, Stagecoach. Enemy Flight is third. Lord Butt is fourth. Big gap then to Lexington Regal. And then Plague Runner, Lord of the National, Panzer and Fearless Amy. Then a big gap again to Bucco and Camp Habs. And they're really split into three groups now. And these this leading group of four really 
of Eager and Keen Stagecoach, Enemy Flight and Lord Bot have got four or five lengths up on the second group, and the second group have got four lengths up on the third group. So they're racing out of sight of the stand then now, and down towards the final mile and a half, and Eager and Keen and Stagecoach from Enemy Flight and Lord Bot. Then a big gap to Lexington, Regal and Panzer, and then Plague Royal. This is going to be a real test, this one now. It's Eager and Keen over that one in the lead from Stagecoach in second. Then comes Enemy Flight and Lord Bot together. Gap of five or six to Lexington Regal. Panzer's behind that one. The third group are beginning to close on the second group. Bucko is at the head of that little group there. The back marker is now Sunday Mott. But it's Eager and Keen and Stagecoach. Eager and Keen and Stagecoach are in the lead by about two lengths to Enemy Flight and Lord Butt. Then a gap back to Lexington Regal. Panzer's after that one. Then Fearless Amy and Lady Matilda and Plague Runner. And suddenly that chasing pack now is beginning to merge into one big group. But it's Eager and Keen who's still in the lead with Stagecoach. And look, Enemy Flight going well in third. Lord Bot in fourth. Over that one they go. That was the twelfth. And over it they go there. Panzer's jumped that really well and has now moved into fifth. And he's still only lost the one. And it's Stagecoach in front. Stagecoach and Eager and Keen having a good battle over this ditch. Over it they all go. And they're all safely over that one as well. With Eager and Keen and Stagecoach still disputing the lead. Lord Bot's now a clear third. Then in fourth is Enemy Flight. Panzer's run on it a fifth. Then Lady Matilda. Lord of the National is next. Then Fearless Amy and Plague Runner. Lexington Regal is next. And a bit of a gap to Bucko and Safin as Josie as they take the 14th. And as a faller there, something's gone. Camp House has gone. So Camp House is a faller. But it's Eager and Keen in the lead from Stagecoach in second. Still. Then come the Murray pair. Lord Bot and Lady Matilda over the 15th. They go. One down his nose then was enemy flight but it's still now eager and keen and stagecoach they've been one and two all the way there's little more than five furlongs to go and it's eager and keen stagecoach lord bot the packer beginning to close on the low over the 16th they got four more to take and it's eager and keen from stagecoach now lord of the national with his unbeaten record on the line comes through to challenge as well on the outside it's lord of the national who's the first one to get past the clutter book there lord of the national takes it up They've got four to take then now. Four more fences to get over. The field are really beginning to pack now. And it's Lady Lord of the National in the lead. From Stagecoach battling back on the inside. Lady Matilda and Plague Runner. Then on the inside is Eager and Keen. Over that final ditch they go. And suddenly there's a fall there. Lord Bot's gone. And now Lady Matilda's been in the lead. It's Lady Matilda who's gone on. Where's Lord of the National gone? It's suddenly hit the wall. It's Lady Matilda coming out towards the third last. Lady Matilda lands in front. From Plague Runner in second. Lord Bot went as well. Not long ago, it's Lady Matilda in the lead from Plague Runner. Bocco now, the local horse is running on into third. Then Fearless Amy and Stagecoach over the second last they go. And Lady Matilda's in front. Lady Matilda from Plague Runner. And Bocco's beginning to run on. So too's Panzer. They've got one more to take. Coming towards his final fence is Lady Matilda. Lady Matilda gets over it. Bocco's over it in second. Panzer's over it in third. It's Lady Matilda in front. The local horses are closing, but Lady Matilda is going to break local hearts and take it up towards the line. Lady Matilda wins it puns a second book oh third fearless Amy fourth and you're in Keenan Lebanese and Jim Murray takes the Warwick classic chase biggest race of the season at Warwick looked like it was going to go to the local trainer for a moment and he got second and third he'll take that uh, Lady Matilda takes it for Jim Murray Panzer was second for Martin Leedham. Bucko was third for Martin Leedham as well. Fearless Amy for Ryan Tamasevi was fourth. And Eager and Keen, long-time leader for Graham Clutterbuck, was fifth.